Hi, once again, welcome to my YouTube channel. Result delightful lessons, and I have here another tutorial video to share. And uh, we will focus on how to use Google Meet for an online class. Although this Google Meet can also be used to any video conferences like uh, webinars, as we call it now, and uh, as I have mentioned from my previous uh, videos that we can use different platforms um, in delivering uh, quality education to our learners for the next school year 2020-2021. So fellow educators, join me as we uh, will unveil how to use Google Meet for an online class. So let's start and uh, enjoy learning. Okay, so first you need to open a browser. So I have here already click Google or google.com. So once you are here, you may go directly to here the Google uh, apps and uh, you click this. Then you look for the um, application that you are going to use. For example, we are then of course with classroom then click this google meet this is the icon for google meet and let's wait because it's still processing then there so we have here the interface for the google meet and it says there it's premium video meetings now free for everyone and uh, we re-engineered the service we built for secure business meetings Google Meet to make it free and available for all. So you can, if you have already the link, you can just enter there. Then the setting here, then new meeting, you can see it there. So once you wish to start a meeting, you can click this one. Then once you click it, so you can see this word joining and it's getting ready as you can see here so as you can see it's google meet google.com so you can just click that one if you don't have a direct um, google account yet so there so you can uh, turn or mute your microphone or turn off then you can also turn off your video if you don't wish to be seen then once you click that one so it will be marked red so it must be in red color so that signals that your camera and video is off then you can click join now or present so this is the link you can copy this link because this will be given to your friends or students so once you click join you will be directed to this part then add others so this is still our link so this is very important if you wish to invite people then you can also add people then if you know their names or their email so you can uh, directly enter here or you can just click invite here so there so you can see all your friends there then this one you can see it it's still one because you were not able to invite yet then people you will see here once you have given the link and they join your your class or your webinar then you will see them then you need you can also see your face there as you then for the chat you can also say hi then hello you can have your questions here and uh, you can also click the meeting details so still you have there the link then you can have attachments then here if you wish to present your slides then once you uh, click this uh, present now you will see three choices your entire screen a window or a chrome chrome tab 
then once you click that entire screen all or the entire screen can be seen by your um, learners then you can then there so if you wish to stop presenting you can just click that that one and then here stop sharing also so there we go back to a window so a window for example if you wish to share your slides you can do that one so click uh, a window if you have powerpoint presentations for example and then you can stop presenting here or you can just okay for example let's click and then you can also click there then let's go back to another a chrome tab a chrome tab is uh, since we have google chrome so whatever uh, browser you you have opened earlier then you can share it to your uh, students or learners then this three dot you can see you can change layout then you can select here sidebar spotlight or tile then once you click that uh, you will see change on the screen then once you put it into spotlight or tiled so again we cannot see it because i don't have any invited uh, participants yet then you can also press the escape, uh, escape. then once you click also uh, you can turn off then setting and everything here so, so again we are navigating the the buttons of this google me then let's continue so you can also if you wish to leave the call now or the meeting you can just click this one and then if you wish to rejoin and return to home screen you can also do it then for example you click rejoin then it it will direct you to the meeting once again or to the session then camera is starting that will uh, first pop and then if you wish not to be heard then you can you can uh, turn off your microphone and if you don't want to be seen turn off your video then so that is so uh, how google meet works then for example you click once again your join join now and then um because i just want to go back with with an important part which is the setting so once you click the setting you can also customize your audio then you can click this one and then you can have choices it's up to you then you can also customize or you can change the setting of your video okay so these are the default uh, setting then let, let's go back with that and then we have the general so since we don't have any general report yet so we cannot do that one so let me just x that one then if you wish to leave now then uh, you just click the, that icon then if you wish to return to the home screen this would uh, be the interface so this is the main or the main uh, uh, screen of uh, the google meet then you can uh, start a new meeting once again for example you click this start a meeting so we are doing the recap then again it asks you about if you wish to turn off or turn on your microphone and uh, and video so i prefer not to be seen uh, yet so again this is the important uh, link ever you can copy 
the link is very important and for example if you start and then you have your link and then you can just paste it here and then click join so you can join a meeting immediately since you have already the link so that's how it works then of course I didn't want to be seen I didn't want to be heard so you can click that one again that could be basic netiquette so if someone is talking so you can just you can unmute and mute or turn off and turn on because this is the term for the Google Meet. It's turn off and turn on. Not like the others, it's mute or unmute. That's how Google Meet works and I hope you learned something new today and you can start now your meeting or online classes using this platform, Google Meet. So I wish to see you in the future meetings uh, via Google Meet. Thank you very much for listening to me. This is Rizaldi Lightful Lessons and this is Google Meet. Enjoy!